you guys been? I hope you guys are well. This is your girl, I'm telling you. Today, I'm going to do something different. I think this will be a Sunday video, so obviously. I'm going to go and try to see if I can do my hair and do a little bit of shopping. So I'm ready, look my hair. Right now, I detangle myself because I don't trust people. So I detangle myself, I'm going to go if I can do a soap press because I need to cut my split in so I just saw a salon not far from where I'm working so I'm going to go there and check if it can do it if it cannot today I had to do it myself which I don't know if I'll be able to that's why I'm going this early normally I'll be sleeping in my bed chilling with that kind of stuff so yeah I'm getting ready I can't carry you with me and all that stuff but i'm going to ask them if i can film in there that's why i have my phone stand with me and i'm going to go to do a little bit of shopping so i may take you guys with me i will see how it goes in anyway. i'm back i went to the um salon that I told you guys about and she said they do it natural hair and soap press all that kind of stuff but they do it by booking i was like me book it might be like a month before actually going to be able to do my hair so it's like no i'm not having that so i had to do my hair myself <laughs> i don't even know if i'm going to succeed but i was able to do some shopping like my daycare body care face care whatever they call it and uh, shopping which is in that bag i have a lot of things in there um i also did some food shopping which i'm going to be eating this month so so this video is going to be me with my natural hair let's see if i'll be able to actually do that so press but i need to cut my split in so i'm going to do my hair so i'm going to hop in the shower and i may take you guys with me it depends how i feel like hey guys so i'm going to wash my hair down look at the hair you can see the white flakes that's the gel and the glue i think and uh, all the flakes is like oh uh, but i'm going to tell you what shampoo i'm going to use to wash my hair the shampoo i'm going to use is is a cream of nature organ oil from morocco is a softly free moisture and shine shampoo has my conditioner i'm going to use the olive oil professional replenish conditioner and has my deep conditioner i'm going to use the moisture miracle moroccan clay and shea butter detox and soften heat active marks you're wondering why am i using so many products for my hair it's because i'm going to use heat a lot like today and i want my hair to be like healthy when i go into that much heat i'm planning to put on how you guys can see i'm just resting my hair with some warm water Next, I start shampooing my hair in section, like I already separate them. I take some part, some of the shampoo in my hand and rub it in through my fingers and go in between my hair twists so I can be on my scalp and not on my actual hair. And I start scrubbing. I make sure to run through the product to my end so that it will be clean, but I don't wash my hand that much i pay attention mostly to my root after that i take my skull massage and start massaging a bit my scalp after resting my hair i check if it's detangled and retwist my head guys i'm not used to took over my video that's kind of awkward for me <laughs> so please don't mind me if i'm a little bit awkward with this after finishing washing my hair out I go to, into the condition I start from the back I always make sure I start from the back before going at the front I don't know why I just always get used to it I separate the two twists that are done on the back so it'll be easier to manage and I start putting the product into my hair and I make sure that I pay attention to finger detangle my hair with it how you can see it goes smooth through it and I use a lot of product especially my conditioner so that it will be much easier to manage and detangle my hair and guys i was rocking the music uptown road by little nas so you see me dancing here and there Maybe yeah. after tying up i go back to the next one which is my other side of the head and do the same thing but let's move on to the next part because that's too long i was taking my sweet time doing my hair so i will cut this part and i'll tell you what i do after i finish it put it all the conditioner around my head okay after putting the product in my hair i tie my hair back up i go to the next part 
and I go until I finish it. I done two at the back on both sides on my left and right side. So four at the back and I done three at the front for both sides my left and right. So I done six at the front. So four at the back, six at the front. That's the hair product that is my sink. I didn't lose that much hair. Literally nothing at all. Just showing you guys the process of how I do and make sure I don't shed that much hair. After putting the product in my hair and separate them, I rinse the product out. I don't leave it for that long. I only leave it for two minutes or I don't even leave it for that long. Sometimes I just put the product and rinse it. Sometimes I leave it. Sometimes I do it as my deep conditioner if I don't want to do too much things. It depends how I feel like it. But because I'm going to be doing a heap, I mean put heat in my hair, I decided to rinse it out early and do a deep conditioner. After rinsing the conditioner out of my hair, I take a t-shirt to dry a little bit of the water, but not too much because I still need that water to do my deep conditioner. And while I'm putting my deep conditioner, I make sure to detangle my hair with a comb instead of finger detangle. I finger detangle, but I also detangle with a comb. I start by separate my twist and make sure it's easy to put the product in. I use my finger to go throughout my hair and be gentle with it so I don't snap it. I take a good amount of deep conditioner and run it through my hair and make sure I pay attention to the end of my hair like my my hair the end I don't want it to be dry because that's where all the old hair is so I need to add more moisture right there after running through with the product with my fingers I use the detangle comb to brush out my hair and after that I twist it back it back up and don't mind me I'm just eating gum because I'm tired and I was hungry I needed something to distract me After putting all the deep conditioner marks on my hair, I put a plastic bag over it and I'm going to leave it for a couple of minutes. So I'm thinking half an hour, that's all for, but I actually left it for an hour on my hair because I ended up putting a heat cap on my hair. As you guys can see, I'm taking all my hair out of my comb because I didn't really have that much breakage in my hair, which I was happy. And that's the end result of my detangle. Not that much. After taking the one in the top, that's all I ended up losing. Not much. Hey guys, I didn't tell you, but I put my hair in a heat cap. So this was it. And it's been like that for an hour. And if you guys are what it was in my face, it's a face mask, which I'm trying. I just got it today is the um, brightening turmeric removal impurity energy face mask I have no idea what that is about but it's a face mask that I just got from super drop that I went shopping for and I'm going to go have a shower now because it's time for me to rinse this thing out and rinse my hair out so I'm going to have a shower rinse this thing out clean my face and then come back and start doing my hair. Straighten my hair, blow dry my hair, do the soco, cut my split and whatever. Oh my God, that's a long process, but I'm trying to finish today because tomorrow I'm working and it's 3.34 right now. So let's see how long it will take me to do all of this because I know I'm going to take like an hour, not really an hour, yeah, about half an hour in the bathroom because of all of this body cleaning I need to do, whatever, but still. So yeah, first of it was my mouth, right? It's something else. Anyway, see you guys when I'm hey ready. Guys, I just finished rinsing my hair and having the bath. I'm with that stuff. Got my flesh. I'm with that stuff. Hey guys, this is future Stephanie editing video here. I guys can see I decided to do a two-part because I saw that it was actually longer for my wash and process my wash days because there was so much data I wanted to give you guys in it but I wasn't able to give you all the details so I said let me do the wash part video separate and then the, the soap press and trying to soap press my hair which I flopped badly but let's not go into that much detail until you see it um to in two parts if you're really interested in just process keep watching and thank you again for coming back
Thank you.